morning, babes. So, I just, well, I woke up, like, quite a while ago. But I'm about to take a shower, brush my teeth, wash my face, do the whole nine yards. I do have to go to corporate America in, like, some hours. So, what I'm about to do is try to go to my last appointment. Um, I'm so tired. I already wanted to do that. I need my nails and my toes done. I'm trying to see if I'm gonna just do my toes. Or my nails. I'm not sure. I might not be able to get all that stuff done at one time though, so I think I might just do, I was thinking about doing my nails. I might just do my brows, I mean my lashes. I don't know, they all look so boyish right now, not having them done, so I'm just going to go get showered and dressed, and then I guess I'll come back on here and give you guys an update, probably when I'm about to leave or when I'm Trying to get a quick lash appointment, y'all. Hopefully they answer. Good morning, Stone Mary. Yes, is this Mel? Yeah. Hey, Mel, it's Lisa. I'm trying to see if I can come get my lashes done right now. Uh, Mom, Mom, not here yet. C can you come on, you know? 9.30. Yes. Okay. Okay, thank you. Sure. All right. Yeah. Okay, y'all, so look, I'm headed to go get my lashes done right now. I had to pull a last minute. Um, I have to be to Corporate America at 10.45 this morning, so I'm gonna go catch this 9.30 appointment, and right when I leave there, I'm gonna head straight there. In fact, I was wondering, I was thinking about getting either a coffee or a tea, and I'm actually thinking if I should, it, or even matcha, I'm just thinking right now, should I go get my lashes? Because I'll probably be done with my lashes no later than about 10 10 she normally takes about 20 to 30 minutes um give or take hopefully she's right on it because i have somewhere to be um not to rush her but baby y'all open up at nine you're running late 9 30 so basically what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna head there y'all this morning has been a pooped morning not in the sense of like you de you determine how you want your day to go okay you can either be stuck in a funk or, but let me just tell y'all. So all of my black clothing that I literally, I, we wear black like all the time. You guys know I wear black because it's my favorite color. I wear it all the time. And then we have to wear black in the company, typically. So baby, all of my clothing is piled up with black clothes. I don't know if my washer, I think my washer might have a shortage in it. And it has for a while. I just was manipulating the handles to try to make it turn on. And every time I'm like trying to turn the nozzles, the, um, the little nozzles, they're like broken anyway, but I'm trying to work with them. So I'm gonna have to go online and try to order some quick little washer machine knobs, baby. Every time I'm trying to jump on there, I kid you not, the, the start won't start to the dryer or to, the, yeah, to the dryer. So uh, literally, everything is still wet so i had to take everything out this morning for it to air dry um who you clocking i can't stand when the police officers just sit in the parking lot and just be clocking people like it's too early for all of that um so yeah so long story short y'all i had to hang dry well like lay all of my clothing out so that they can air dry and then after i laid all the clothing out um i ended up having to dang now i need guys i hate when this happens after i laid the clothing out i still had to pick something so i had to choose these like pants that are like they could i mean depending on how you wear them they could look dressy they could look like workout and then i have this little jacket <coughs> excuse me and then I have this like under crop top that's honestly, y'all, not gonna hold you. It's slightly damped, slightly damped. I don't like, <sighs> it's just been a morning, honey. Everything, black under uh, garment bras, not dry. So I brought it with me for it to air dry. And I know somebody gonna be like, she got a 
a t-shirt and a bra air dryer in her car and do and do um because i didn't want to be completely out of dress code but i kid y'all not like all of my black clothing is like a no or if it's black and it's like i could wear it it's just not appropriate for the weather it's just too hot so i'm like what are the chances and i've been doing constant laundry it's just i feel like between me wearing black all the time and then me having to wear black for this company it's like i'm blacked out okay because it's weeks and weeks and weeks that i keep going back four or five times out the week and it's just different outfits different so that's why sometimes it's like get used to trying to make a uniform because that's basically what it's coming down to um and then some of my black holes that I do own are getting so thrown into the rotation that I feel like now I'm gonna have to be doing a black like clothing giveaway soon because things are fading things are I'm just wearing things too frequently now like way too much in the same rotation so oh I know him I sure do know him he better still drive that Porsche Anyway, so your girl is headed up here. They said she should be here at 9.30. Sis, be here at 9.30, please. If she takes too long, I'm just not going to get them done because I'm not about to be late because I'm trying to. But I need them done. So we're going to do that. I don't have on any makeup. Um, I, I need my toes done and my nails done, but I don't, I'm not going to have time for that. <clears throat> now, if they could do my nails while they're doing my lashes, that would be stellar. But don't see it happening. So let me tell baby let me tell you how who baby they just worked some rah-rah for me let me put my seatbelt on and tell y'all how this this situation just played out okay so i had a lash appointment they said come at 9 30 i was trying to go at nine so i don't be late to corporate america because i didn't get to pre-schedule it my schedule has literally not allotted for me to be making my appointments like that some days unless I'm off and if I'm off and I'm busy and it's not like I can't get that into my schedule on my off days then it's been difficult so I'm like look trying to get there at nine they're like well we have a um they were like she's gonna be here at 9 30 I'm like okay cool bet so long story short sis got here okay they driving slow sis got ended up getting here at um 9:23. so good thing i went in already right so i ended up going in just like as a i'll wait seven to ten minutes until she gets here i'm early baby she was there so i start she probably started on my lashes at 9 25 i looked at the clock it was 9 48 she was already done this is what your girl lashes look like so they looking good but she was already done so i said period so I noticed that it was 948 and I don't have to be to Corporate America to 1045. So I said, mm. my nail girl, my usual nail girl takes an hour and probably 20 something. I've timed her before. It's like an hour and 25 minutes, hour and 30 minutes. She takes about 25 to 30 minutes longer than the average nail tech, right? Baby, I told him, look, it's 948. I only have until about 1015 for you to do my nails. Baby, it's, it's like 10, it's 10, 18 right now. I was getting up from his chair at, like he was done around 10, 10, but then I had him, um, I went and go wash my hands and get lotion and stuff like that um, to put moisturize my hands again. And y'all, he ended up fouling my toenail for me because I had, I, girl, I broke it and, um, or chipped it and it was looking tacky. Baby, he fouled my toenail for me and I got up out of there. So long story short, he did from 9.48. Oh, snap. From nine, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead, thank you. Thank you. I had the stop sign, but I think I beat her to it. It don't matter if two people are directly behind their line. It's like who gets there first. With the, I got somewhere to be, so I'm trying to get the heck up out of here. Um, yeah that was really weird where i just was because it almost looks like it's not a stop sign until you start committing it looks like a yield but really it's a stop sign um but i got somewhere to be but y'all so long story short he ended up getting my nails done in about 12 15 in about 20 minutes like like he said he was 
going to be able to do. Because I was like, look, whoever did my nails got to get them done within 20 to 25 minutes. I said, that's not to make anybody feel pressure. If y'all are not able to do it, I understand that it's asking for a lot. But if y'all are able to do it, I would appreciate it. I can get it in and I have to reschedule. So, y'all, he got my nails done from 9.48 to 10.15. He was done with everything and filed my toenail. That's literally like 20-something minutes, y'all. It's 20-something minutes. Whereas my nail girl takes an hour, like hour and a half, three hour or whatever. And I don't like, she's really good. So that's why I've been going to her for so long. But I, I cannot afford sitting for an hour and a half to get my nails done. That's just like, I don't even like to sit that long to get my nails done. So that's already like a situation for me in itself. So long story short, she did that for me. And I was like, period. So, I'm literally headed to the job now. I should be getting there on time. I took the streets, the other streets that, that will allow me to get here um, fast. I hope there's no cops out because I'm hitting it. So, I'm still going to make it to the job on time. My gas light just came on, but I'm not going to push it and get gas because if I do, then I'm probably not going to get coffee or a matcha, and I don't need that type of lifestyle today. I need my coffee. Come on, folks. It's a camera on this light, too. Baby, we got all green lights so far. We ain't got time to stop. Gas, no brakes. That's when it comes down to the goals. That's when it comes down to life. We on the gas, no brakes, baby. So look, y'all. So remember I told y'all, between today and tomorrow, I need to be thinking about what... There's a beet farm right there. Oh, my gosh. There's a farm kitchen right there. Like a beet farm kitchen right there. Oh, I had to tap in. So y'all, yeah. Starbucks is right there. I don't trust it that I will be on time if I went to it because it looks like the line is long. So I'm going to just bet on the one that's in the um, near the location. It's just sometimes the line gets long. So hopefully it's not long this morning because it's not going to be that many people. Um, so that's what I'm going to try to go for this morning. But uh, that's what I'm going to try to go for this morning. Um, or whatever because I need me some coffee or matcha or something to get started for my day so I'll keep you guys up to date I haven't eaten anything so I'm definitely gonna have to be focused so yeah I'm definitely gonna have to focus because who oh child I'll be there until about I think four or something today so I'm gonna have to be focused um for these hours i haven't eaten anything like i said so y'all i meant to show y'all my coat because my sugar was feeling low so i needed a coat do y'all see how small this can is he said they sell they sell them at costco i haven't seen i have never seen this can before in my life so the serving size is one can and it's only 90 calories and y'all i guess they come in six packs and they are a seven and a half ounce coke it's smaller than the standard coke can and i just thought that that was just so different Come on, girl. I'm letting you over, so let's go. Um, I thought that was so different. I said, wow. A lot of times I don't like to eat breakfast, but I have like a matcha or coffee mid-morning. And a lot of times that will suffice, you know, like that will suffice things for me. And baby, my sugar was so low. So let me talk to you in a little bit um, because I'm at this light right now. And I want to just take some time to just enjoy me for a couple of minutes um, because I'm about to be people, but I'm about to be occupied by uh, customers and stuff like that soon. Um, oh my freaking goodness. There's a spider on me. Oh my God. Oh my God. There's a. What in the absolute. Oh my God. And the people just see me later. I don't care. There was a. Oh my God gosh I was oh my gosh like oh my goodness wow 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 do y'all know the heart attack that would have came out of that if that thing would have bit my stomach oh my gosh I'm glad I looked down I don't even know what made me look down if that would have wow Wow, 
bro, if I... Wow. 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 Y'all, let me just... Let me Look, talk hey, to babe. So, I just wanted to chime in real quick, follow up with y'all. I don't want no copyright issues on my... Um, recording so look before I got out of the car earlier there was a spider on me and I thank God right now that I discovered that spider was on me because just thinking back like I really don't know what I would have done if I didn't realize the spider was on me and it bit me or something I probably would have probably went into a it felt like a heart attack because to see something on me like that and not realize that it was on me that was like that was nerve-wracking getting out of hand anyway i need to grab something to eat because i haven't really eaten anything all day all i had was um coffee and that little can of coke from this morning they get the sugar going but i haven't eaten food and normally when i'm the only person working i normally don't go nowhere to go get food so if i didn't bring anything with me then chances of me actually eating right away is not gonna happen so i haven't eaten anything at all today i'm super hungry um I'm going to try to stop into one of the spots I like to go to. Holly grab me something. If not, I'm going to just... I want to go shoot some pool because I just need to, like, blow off some steam and just kind of, like, focus. So, I might go do that. I know normally when I go up there, I get french fries and stuff like that. But today, I'm not sure if I'm going to try to do... I don't like how you all up on my bumper, so... Because um, this lane is going to merge regardless. So, you might as well drive. So... Yeah, but yes, y'all. Um, yeah, the lane merges. So I'm so hungry. I can't even think. You know, there is a Chick Fil A concert. You know that line's going. Oh no! But I wanted to get me some French fries, barbecue sauce. Okay, y'all, so I was supposed to come back and finish the vlog. I never did, so make sure y'all like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Still at the pool hall, still shooting pool. See y'all later.